Newsland UST, we start with the daily chart. Okay, based on daily chart, if you refer back to my last two weeks analysis when the price was somewhere around here, we mentioned that we have a divergence based on the MACD and based on these indicators. Okay, and we explained that mostly we're looking for the bigger correction before we get the continuation. That's mean we mentioned that the possibility of the price can reverse is very low. Okay, and now we see this is the only we, we see in the future this is the only correction or how big will be this correction before we get the continuation okay anyway we don't have much more information based on daily chart in this case we move to lower time frame and see how we can trade it okay what i want to say if we refer back again to my last two week analysis we mentioned that we get i mean when the price was somewhere around here we mentioned that the possibility we get a correction similar to what we have here here the mostly we can get it and what we get is bigger than what we have here, okay? And there, it doesn't matter. And the reason we, what we're looking for, we're looking for for this correction before we get the, this up move, okay? Now the thing is, we need to see next week how big this one will be, whether the price from here can reverse or we get the one more correction, the price can drop. That's mean we get the bigger correction, okay? Anyway, this is what we were expecting and what we have right now and we see how we can trade for the next week and one thing if we put this one in relative to this and if we refer to make we have a divergence and even based on this okay i know the question is next week can we expect the up move from here that's mean if we get any buy setup we are more interested but what i explain right now still there is a possibility we get the next week we get the one more correction here the price can drop a bit lower still there is a this possibility we need to see what we will get here but in the longer term we are more interested in this move that's mean we're more interested in the buy now the question is how we can trade it in this case we move to lower time frame based on lower time frame if we compare these two to each other based on macd still we have a divergence is near to is like very close to the this low, but still we have a divergence, but we don't rely on this based on one hour chart. And what I want to say that for the next week, we are more interested in the buy. If we get the buy setup, we will look for it. And the buy from, because we don't have any buy setup from right, I mean, from here right now, what we explain for, based on what we have right now is that if we get any sharp move with small flag, we look for buy. Okay, that's mean, again, we're looking for the buy. How how deep this one can go, whether we get the buy from here or lower, we are not sure. But if we get the buy, we look for buy and what we want, we want the price come to this high. But if we get the buy from here or lower, as long as the price come to this level, we start to manage it. Why? May we get the bigger correction. One, two, we get the bigger correction and the price can drop. Okay, even there is a possibility the price come to this before come to this level drop similar to what I draw here. But from now, we consider if we get any buy, as long as the price come to this level, we start to manage it. And next week, if we get a buy, if the price I see move somewhere higher, but didn't come to this high, high and we see it's not moving, then from there, we start to manage it. But for our analysis, based on what we have right now, if we get the buy, the price come to this level, we start to manage it. Okay, that's mean for the next week, we are more interested in the buy up move. Is there any possibility we get the correction here for the next move down? Yes. If we get the, the price next week, we start to correct similar to what I draw here. We still, we can look for buy, but uh, sorry, for sell. But any sell we consider as a short term sell. That's mean as long as the price drop, get into the profit or break this low, we start to manage it. Because still we can consider we have this correction. We get one more correction similar to what we have here for the next move down before we get the up move. Okay. Anyway, the question is whether we get the up move, the start of the up move will be here or still we get the, get the correction before we get, we get the up move. That's mean how deep this one can go. We are not sure. Anyway, we don't have any trade setup. The only thing is for the next week, we need to wait and see what we will get here. Then from there, we make a decision. And next week, when the market open, if I see any update, any changes, and any trade setup, then I will share on YouTube. Thanks.